factors. We are excited to share this overview of Amplify ELA and look forward to partnering with you to bring engaging and rigorous instruction to your students. Amplify ELA is the only ELA program built specifically for middle school students. There is so much happening to a young adolescent student, from physical development to psychological and social development, and most importantly, cognitive development. The human brain develops at a rapid pace during young adolescence, growth that is only outpaced during infancy. It is during the middle school years, however, that the brain's cognitive development is at its peak, which builds skills such as critical thinking, organizational capacity, and developing multiple perspectives. Middle school students are ready to be pushed as thinkers and engaged differently. They learn by doing and practicing through interacting with their peers and developing their meaning-making muscle. Building these skills are of critical importance, as we know that students who fail a sixth grade literacy course are 50% more likely to not graduate from high school. Amplify ELA addresses the needs of middle school students by tackling these three points head on. Ed Reports is an educator-led, evidence-based organization that independently reviews K-12 instructional materials. In our review, Amplify ELA scored all green across all three middle school grades, meaning our ELA products met all expectations of all of their criteria. Number one, text quality and complexity and alignment to standards components. Number two, building knowledge with texts, vocabulary, and tasks. And three, usability. Let's dive into the curriculum. The program provides what a teacher needs to teach to the standards and follow the pedagogy of the frameworks. And as you can see from the art and unit names, each one of these units has been crafted by educators, writers, and artists to capture students' and teachers' imaginations in a unique way. Amplify ELA provides a full year of curriculum in each grade, all focused on complex and rigorous texts. Doll and Narrative in sixth grade draws students into the childhood memories of Roald Doll, and before they know it, they are close reading texts like a pro. In the middle of sixth grade, students encounter their first research unit, the chocolate collection. Here, they learn information literacy skills, such as how to validate a source, and then how to effectively research a topic. They start by exploring primary source documents and multimedia focused on the history of chocolate. Eighth grade begins with a more demanding memoir by Dahl that takes students into the throes of World War II. In the units that follow, students look at great thinkers and inventors whose use of language was so powerful that they changed the world. The units are a mix of literary and informational units, and each grade level also includes a dedicated novel study. In the sixth grade, students read The Summer of the Mariposas, a hero's journey story written by Guadalupe Garcia McCall that follows sisters as they journey to Mexico. In the seventh grade, students complete a play study as part of the Character and Conflict Unit, where they read A Raisin in the Sun by Lorraine Hansberry. And finally, in the eighth grade, students read Gris Grimley's Frankenstein, an engaging graphic novel based on Mary Shelley's iconic story. Amplify is pleased to partner with Poetry in America to create new lessons and content that get students and teachers truly excited about poetry. The online lessons include tips for leading rich classroom discussions on poetry and videos of a wide variety of interpreters close reading poems. Interpreters include Shaquille O'Neal, Angela Duckworth, Regina Spector, Shiza Shahid, Anson Dorrance, Elizabeth Alexander, Richard Blanco, and Dwi Doan. Let's hear what students love about Amplify ELA. My favorite part of Amplify was probably when we did Red Scarf Girl. I love history. I like the part where it like tells us to get in like groups with classes and have us partner up. I like interacting with my peers because Everybody has their own opinion. I enjoyed the cask of Amontillado the most because it was like more interactive and it helped me 
like with writing? With Amplify, it has a text with it so you can cite evidence, you could copy and paste, you can do all these good things that other stuff can't. It's useful for multiple things. One of the main reasons is helping me understand words, to expand my vocabulary and exercise our vocabulary. I like the library because it has cool books. I like to read about mystery, how you can figure out things and use examples or things that they say, basically putting a puzzle together. Yeah, it's made me more patient with explaining my work more than just writing about it. It helped me with um, citing evidence more than I usually did. It's more engaging because it's, it's more fun to read it. You become a better reader when you have someone to talk to and kind of read to and engage with. Amplify ELA is a blended program that offers both print and digital components. The print consists of a teacher's guide, student edition, and student writing journal. It is designed to be used in conjunction with the digital product, whether students are on devices or teachers are projecting from their device. Amplify recognizes that every school may not have the resources to teach solely from a device and develop these print materials to ensure that 100% of the standards are covered anywhere, regardless of how often students are interacting with the digital curriculum. There are digital experiences that should not be missed, but can be taught in a lab setting or if a cart is available, allowing for teachers to have flexibility in the execution of the instruction. Amplify's Teacher Edition is a traditional print resource that guides the teacher through each lesson and points to digital assets that can be projected to the classroom. It contains the student edition with a wraparound that highlights differentiation and English language learner supports, group work, writing activities, vocabulary, and other lesson highlights. Amplify ELA provides 100% standards-aligned lessons in both print and digital formats, with instant access to standards available as teachers move through the lessons. Instruction in each lesson focuses on one or two standards that best support the work in that lesson, highlighted in orange here. These standards are defined as a lesson's focus standard. The standards are spiraled throughout the curriculum, meaning students will have multiple interactions with the standards throughout the year. The student edition contains the text excerpts for each lesson, along with vocabulary support and artwork to assist in reading the text. Students will interact with the text through the use of the student writing journal, which allows them to visualize and work with the text in multiple ways. Every Amplify ELA lesson follows the same instructional model. The lesson begins with adaptive vocabulary practice. As students complete vocab activities correctly, the questions become more difficult. If they begin to answer questions incorrectly, the questions ease in difficulty. From there, the teacher starts the class. The first part of the lesson is the close read. Students read analytically to build content knowledge and analyze writers' intentions, choices, and claims. They do so through a wide variety of activities, intentionally designed to engage them in the text. Next is the performance task, where students develop and present their ideas. Students write frequently in Amplify ELA, two to three times a week, and also participate in Socratic seminars, discussions, performances, role-playing, and other activities. Finally, the lesson ends with reflection. Amplify lessons offer two ways for students to reflect on learning at the end of the lesson, through an exit ticket or through a wrap-up, a teacher-led activity that engages the students in group discussion. Solos offer students the ability to apply their knowledge by answering a range of auto-scored questions that track their reading comprehension. Amplify ELA allows me to, to walk in with a plan. I have a target. I know what my students are going to learn that day. It's kind of having that roadmap already and then letting me as a teacher decide what works for which class group or which style or what's going on for that day or what skills we really need to hit. So the data comes in and then I can adjust. I felt like sometimes all I was doing was asking the, the children to produce, but I wasn't trying to get them there. And so I feel with Amplify, 
I'm taking them one step at a time. So then they come to the end with like all their tools. They have vocabulary. They understand concepts like dramatic irony. It's all accessible in one program and they don't have to go out and piece together the content. The, the teachers really like the fact that the, the lessons are planned, they're paced, um, but they also have the ability to have a lot of flexibility within that program. A typical Amplify ELA unit takes four to six weeks to complete, with daily reading and writing check-ins that offer formative assessment throughout the unit. Every unit includes an end-of-unit summative assessment, an essay assignment. Amplify also offers four benchmark assessments to be administered throughout the year. Within Amplify ELA, we believe in providing the scaffolding and support all students require to be successful. This belief is based on the principle of low floors and high ceilings, activities that all students can begin and then work on at their own level. We accomplish this through effective differentiation that allows each student to learn through his or her own path. We've all seen differentiation like this before, complicated rubrics that require an immense amount of preparation time and the classroom management skills of a ninja. But at Amplify, we firmly believe that all students deserve the right to rich, engaging ELA instruction, regardless of what reading level they're at. We also believe that every student should be reading the same text in class, from your struggling readers and ELLs to your most advanced students. We don't level texts at Amplify because states don't level tests. We expose students to complex texts, and we teach skills through the text. We dive right in, working with text in the first lesson, and we provide the scaffolds that they need to be successful and become confident readers and writers. Here's an example of how we embed differentiation tools in Amplify ELA. Every text excerpt in the program has an audio sample. We also support vocabulary growth through the Reveal tool in our digital program, which is a highlighted word that students can click on if they are unsure of the meaning to reveal a synonym that will guide them through the meaning. In the print version, the same words will be provided on the page. It's these types of embedded, real-time tools that keep students reading. The same texts as the rest of the class. And as you explore the program, you'll see we have a multitude of other activities that support students through the text. Dramatic readings, performances, text visualizations, and apps that provide students, struggling or otherwise, with a multimodal approach to a complex text. No other program has the depth or breadth of differentiated instruction that Amplify ELA has. In addition to audio and vocabulary supports, we provide differentiated instruction for students who are struggling with reading and writing, as well as students performing above grade level. We also offer a specialized level of differentiation specifically targeted to English language learners. Here's an example of a writing prompt with a moderate level of scaffolding. To the left, you can see the writing prompt for students at grade level. Students in the moderate level of differentiation receive text hints and sentence starters that help them respond. This happens automatically in the curriculum. No more referencing back to clunky rubrics in the unit or lesson overview, or hours spent searching for a leveled text or writing prompt that would work for your struggling students. Here's an example of a challenge prompt, which is a differentiation level assigned to students performing above grade level. You can see that in addition to the core prompt, students are directed to write arguments supporting both points of view, ultimately asking them to argue the opposite of how they initially responded. Students can be moved between differentiation levels through a drag and drop capability within classwork, Amplify ELA's dashboard for reviewing student work. We include rubrics to assist teachers in determining which differentiation stream is appropriate for their students and milestones to watch for that would indicate a student's progress from one level to another. The grammar unit in each grade contains 35 lessons in seven subunits that cover key grammar topics for the middle grades. Subunits are paired around a given grammar topic. Within each pair, one subunit covers foundational aspects of the topic, and the other subunit provides both grade level and stretch instruction about the topic. The activities in each lesson are largely self-guided, 
so that students can move independently through the lessons. For specific topics at the class level, Amplify provides four volumes of Mastering Conventions, a supplemental instruction resource available via PDF in the unit overview. The Amplify vocabulary modules provide instruction in skills key to developing vocabulary and building word knowledge. Students also receive instruction and ongoing practice in these skills within the Vocab app. Each vocabulary module is aligned to and integrated into a core instructional unit within each grade of Amplify ELA. The printable Work That Word PDF worksheet accompanies these modules, giving students opportunities to apply the strategies to unit vocabulary while working in either the digital curriculum or print student editions. The Vocab app, a self-guided and adaptive means of learning new vocabulary, introduces students to words that are integral to understanding the texts and key concepts in each unit. When teachers log in each morning, they will see the home screen. Here, teachers will find student performance by period, view solo completion, link to reporting on student writing and other activities, and see which students need written feedback, all in one place. Teachers can also access classwork via the home screen. With classwork, you can review all students' scores on one page and get to an individual's work with just a simple click. While on the Activities tab, click on the student's name to review the individual's submitted work for this activity. Here, you'll see the student's written work. You can review and manually adjust scores generated by the Automatic Writing Evaluation tool. You can also provide immediate feedback through the Comments panel. Notice how the teacher highlighted specific examples from the student's work to help further develop skills. Quickly review and score your entire class by clicking through each student's submitted work. Students receive an alert when work is returned and open envelopes show you that a student has reviewed their feedback. With the Student Portfolio page, you can focus on one student, review the status of each assignment, begin to spot trends in the assignment scores, and quickly jump into the work itself to provide extra feedback when needed. This is a great tool for parent-teacher conferences. Getting student data out of classwork is easy. With just one click, you can export classwork reports. You also have the option to print individual student work, as well as an entire class's worth of work. Both options provide an easy-to-absorb visual representation of student progress and include a cover page, making it that much easier to store in a file, leave for students, or bring to a parent-teacher conference. Additionally, Teachers can check to see how much feedback they are providing to each student's writing. Feedback is a critical part of student growth, and Amplify recommends teachers provide skill-specific, timely feedback to students at least six times per unit. To assist with this, we provide a feedback report to monitor activity. We have seen phenomenal growth in student performance when teachers consistently provide feedback, as much as a 22-point increase on the state assessment. Every four to five lessons, Amplify includes a flex day of instruction. Flex days are offered as opportunities for students to practice skill building activities in the areas of reading, writing, and language. The Embedded Assessment Measure Report provides data that informs teachers of each student's performance across the three core strands. For flex day planning, Amplify ELA provides reporting that informs teachers of student performance. Scoring on these metrics is informed by student activity in the digital curriculum and is a culmination of available data points, such as reading comprehension, automated writing evaluation scores, grammar, and vocabulary. This data provides a grouping profile for teachers to use in planning flex day activities and informs differentiation leveling. Finally, we can't talk about Amplify ELA without mentioning our digital library. Included with every Amplify ELA license, the library consists of over 700 full texts, including every text from the program. Students can choose from a wide variety of genres, covering all levels of reading, 
from 3rd through 12th grade levels. Texts are downloadable to a device, meaning kids can access them from home without requiring an internet connection. We understand that there are novels that are important to teachers and a key part of lesson planning, and that they may not be in the Amplify ELA curriculum. That's why we have Amplify ELA's collection of novel guides, a series of short lessons for each novel that can accompany the core curriculum. Thank you for your time today. We hope that you find Amplify ELA to be an engaging, rigorous, and exciting new option for your middle school students.